The higher we get, the less air there is between us and the sun, and that air is really important in toning down the intensity of the sunlight. In fact, we have several times the intensity of sunlight here at elevation than they have on the beaches of Malibu. That's not an earth-shaking revelation, but that fact's impact on the coping strategies that high elevation plants have are. They only need so much light for photosynthetic process, and they really need to protect themselves from water loss. A significant portion of the growing season, these plants are in a drought condition. There are plenty of drying winds, and the intense sunlight provides plenty of energy to help water jump into the vapor state. Plants make their own sunscreen and shade. They do it by forming waxy surfaces which filter tissue damage and light radiation, and they'll grow bristles and hairs that keep light and wind from their surface. They'll also orient their leaves so that the sun's full power isn't hitting them face on. Now, oh, there's no SPF 30 for these guys. They're a natural wonder of Wyoming. From the University of Wyoming Cooperative Extension Service, I'm Eric Peterson.